Okay, this is Trap Red. We're looking at a schematic, service schematic for a Roland D50, which it's another type of keyboard. It's not at all really similar, but I thought since I had a modification for the D50 circuit that maybe it might be similar enough to the uh, XP to actually be able to work, but I don't think so because this is the contrast circuit right here, LCD contrast. Notice this looks like a thermistor right here, and it uh, it's set to ground to provide a variable resistance right here with the temperature, and then the actual varistor or whatever the the VR variable resistor feeds that voltage. Let's see, right up to this VO, VO, the VO, and that connects to pin 3, and what he's doing is he's taking the VO and just grounding it to the digital ground, and that's producing a full-on contrast as black as it will go, so that it's not variable anymore, but it, by grounding that line which is controlled by this circuit. He's able to um, effectuate a better display, a darker display, one that's no longer variable, but I don't really care about the variableness of contrast either. I just was wondering if maybe doing something similar would produce a similar result but there's no circuit like this on the uh, XP. Going to the XP then, let's see if we can call this up. Get back to where we were. This is on my uh, service notes for the D50. But I have the XP service notes right here. So let's try to call this up and I'll show you the difference. And I got to do some more research, but it seems to be that there's really, if that circuit's vastly different, which it is, then it's not going to work because, anyways, I got to let this resolve for a minute. <clears throat> I already looked at this and I determined that probably it wasn't going to be possible. Now if I can just find the lines. Okay, the lines go right here. Con, right up at the top. Control 1 and Control 0. And they go to this bus. Line, which comes down here. And pulls off here and feeds into this transistor. Where am I? Okay, right here. Control 0, Control 1. They feed those two resistors, 33K and 22K, producing different current when they're enabled, obviously, which I guess that controls something to do with the current flow through this transistor here, the PNP, which then ties into right here, look, this line right here, 14, pin 14, which goes to the LCD display. So I believe that's how they're varying it right here, the CCNT control line, pin 13 it is, not 14. 14 is a supply line. They're taking the 9 volt supply and they're putting it across the diode drop and dropping it down into a <clears throat> Zener diode, which is producing 6 volts, I believe, is what the supply is rated. It says right here, plus 6 volts. So plus 6 volts is 14. And pin 13 is the CCNT, which I believe is the contrast control. So there might be a way to ground that line, I don't know, and uh, 
through a resistor so I don't blow it up. If you ground that line, then this line, this right here, would effectually <clears throat> would be turned on or off, right? Turned on, you turn it on or off. If you turn it on, then you're grounding it. I believe that's how it's working. Don't quote me on that, but this is the circuit that would have to be modified, Q15. So I have to find Q15, R45, R43, R42, measure those components, troubleshoot that, and see. Maybe that transistor's burned out. I don't think so because the display is working. It's just not working properly. The other thing is, is that see how these are sunk in to these capacitors? Any one of those capacitors could be bad. Right here in this bank, it could any one of those could be bad, so I need to check those. And then it could just be that the LTD is defective and it needs to be replaced. So that's where we're at as far as troubleshooting this. And I got the board tore apart, the whole chassis. There's the control board, the main board, what we're talking about, what we just looked at. Okay, and here's the LCD unit it's out and now watch I plug it in I power it's already plugged in let me power it up see watch see it's still funky so that's not going to work let me turn the 